Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I just got home from picking up our Walmart grocery order. All of this was 203.47. I did not do a Walmart order last week. I still need to upload my Sam's Club haul, so I'll do that and then I'll put this grocery haul up so you guys can have both of those the same day. But I was out of quite a few things, um, but I still had like a decent amount of stuff to make dinners with. So I had a couple of substitutions that were fine. One out of stock item, um, which was turkey burger patties. I wanted to do turkey burgers again. We did them last week and Cohen loves burgers and they were out of that. So I forgot to take the buns off of my list because when I went to add them to my cart, they were out of stock. Um, so I got hamburger buns, but no hamburgers or turkey burgers. Um, and then the only other thing is I ordered one of the Asiago peppercorn pork loins. They're one of our favorites and I just do them in the air fryer um at like 400 and depending on the size it takes anywhere from like 30 to 40 minutes for the pork loin and it's cooked perfectly delicious i just do um, some vegetables with it and a salad or maybe some rice or potatoes on the side and i got charged for it but i did not receive it so i already got a refund for that because i let them know that it was missing but i went back over my order a couple of times and that seems to be the only thing that was missing so i didn't have any issues getting anything in stock everything that i needed was for the most part there um, and then I'll just have to add the pork loin to my next grocery order. So we will start over here. I have some Gala apples. Um, I usually buy the honey crisp, but with the prices of groceries, like a four pound bag of the honey crisp apples was like $9. And I was like, mm, these were under $4. So I'm like, Gala apples it is. <laughs> we have some gallon freezer bags and some foil. I also got some spaghetti. Aniston requested spaghetti this week. Um, one of the substitutions, I did order like an Italian pork sausage to put in the spaghetti and they tried to substitute it with hot and I didn't know how spicy that was. Like if her, um, mainly Chris, he does not like spicy, if he would like that. So I just declined that one. So we're gonna just probably do turkey or even chicken sausage. I don't know, we'll figure something out, but we're gonna do spaghetti one night this week. I ordered one of the cracked pepper, sea salt, tuna fishes. Um, they only had one in stock. So that's why I got one. I got the shells and cheese for Jackson. Fly swatters, because there are some flies in my house that I cannot get rid of and I can't find our fly swatter. I got a couple boxes of the Annie's white cheddar mac and cheese. We have oatmeal because Aniston has been on an oatmeal kick again. The way she loves to eat this is I just put it in the microwave for one minute and then when it's still hot, right after I take it out of the microwave, I stir in a big spoonful of peanut butter. It makes it so creamy and so delicious. It, just, it is amazing. And then I top it with a little bit of brown sugar. So that's been like her go-to breakfast for a while now. I have some yogurts. I'm gonna try to hurry through this, you guys, because my camera is flashing low battery. So I'm gonna apologize now. I meant to charge it after my Sam's Club haul last time and I totally forgot. So we have some um, yogurts down here. Some are triple zero, some are the Oikos Pro. The chicken dipping sauce, this tastes just like Chick-fil-A sauce but it's way cheaper. And then we have the yogurt tubes, which is basically Walmart's version of Go-Gurt's. The Too Good yogurt is my favorite. Some strawberries. I threw in one random lemon Too Good because I love this flavor. We have the Laughing Cow spicy pepper jack cheese. Some of this like drink enhancer. It's basically a great values version of Mio. Back here we have body wash for me, some body wash for Chris. We got deodorant for Chris, toothpaste for Cohen and Aniston. And then I thought I only ordered this deodorant, but apparently I put two in my cart. So I got a travel size one that I'll put in my travel bag. And then I have that one, some fat free cottage cheese, cream cheese. I needed one zucchini jerky. I like to get this at Sam's or Costco just because it's a lot more cost effective to do it that way. But I need to go to Costco or Sam's again because there's just things I need to get like chicken and turkey and things like that. So I'll grab that when I go. And my favorite jerky is on sale at Costco right now. So I'm waiting for that coupon book to start. So I grabbed this in the meantime for Chris, a couple different coffee creamers. Here we have white chocolate mocha. I love this one and Southern butter pecan. I love that one too. Half a gallon of milk. We don't really go through milk all that often. Um, really only Chris and Jackson drink it. And then I don't usually drink it that often. So a half gallon, Unfortunately, usually even ends up going bad in our house. I mainly use it for like recipes if we need it. We have goldfish, just regular and flavor blasted. Salty pretzel sticks, they're one of Cohen's favorites. Some grape tomatoes, I love to just snack on these. Um, I got these, I thought these would be fun. The kids all like Chex Mix, but this is the cheddar flavor and this is the perfect size to take to school for a snack. We only have a little over a week and a half left of school. They get out not this Wednesday, but the following Wednesday. Some granola bars, I almost said graham crackers. So some granola bars, we have the fudge dipped coconut and then peanut butter chocolate chip. Bananas, lettuce, Aniston has been on a lettuce kick ever since we had burgers last week. She's always loved salad and lettuce, but like she recently started eating just like iceberg lettuce by itself or dipping it in like ranch. And so I bought another head of lettuce because we already ran out of the other one. 
chicken nuggets another thing i used i usually buy at sam's or costco because it's a lot more cost effective that way but we've actually bought these great value ones before when we've been in a pinch and just needed them for just to have on hand a quick dinner with like our crazy schedules whatnot the next two weeks are just insane with like end of school and graduations and baseball ending and like parties for baseball and graduation parties and all that good stuff and tournaments and so i wanted a couple quick and easy things to have on hand for quick lunches or quick dinners so like the mac and cheese cups jackson likes those all of the kids cohen for the most part i can usually get them to eat a chicken nugget but aniston and jackson love them um these are my favorite frozen vegetables at the moment so they're shredded and it's all right, I am sorry, you guys, my camera died, so I am back and I'm on my phone. So I think I left off telling you guys, I usually buy chicken nuggets at Sam's or Costco, but when I'm in a pinch, I'll grab them from Walmart. So I bought these before. I usually just do them in the air fryer for a few minutes and they're actually not bad, so they like those. Now, my favorite frozen vegetables at the moment, um, you guys all know with the prices of groceries, how insane like inflation is and everything's going up so much. I've been buying a lot of frozen vegetables. Um, they're just as good for you and they don't have a chance to go bad. So I bought two of these because in my opinion, it is a little bit pricey. It's like $3.35 for this. And it's honestly, if I cook this, it's only two days worth of vegetables for me for my lunches because I'll meal prep this. So I've never tried steaming it in the microwave. I cook it on the stovetop with a little bit of olive oil and I add a little bit of seasonings. And it's so good because the potatoes get crispy and kind of remind me of like a shredded hash brown. But this has potatoes, sweet potatoes, broccoli, and cauliflower florets. Like my stomach is literally growling as I talk about this because I'm starving. I went to the gym this morning, came home had a yogurt and some coffee, and then I had to go get my groceries. So I have not eaten like an actual meal yet, and it's 1.15. So I'm trying to hurry through this because not only did my camera die, but I'm starving. I got shrimp, this is cooked. I just like to take this out and thought for Anison, a really quick dinner for her or like a quick snack. She eats this just with cocktail sauce. Pizza rolls, so this is the great value version of pizza rolls. They're actually not bad at all. Jackson really likes them, so this is like an after school snack for him. Cohen and Aniston are not pizza roll fans. We have hard salami. This is one of our favorite salamis. It's actually really good. And we do like the salami and cream cheese roll-ups with those. Canadian bacon for breakfast sandwiches. Here we have the clear American sparkling water. This is the strawberry flavor. More of the extreme wellness wraps, some sugar-free syrup, and some mushrooms. And then we have some bread. This was one of my substitutions. I was actually just getting the great value brand, honey wheat bread, and they substituted it for the Sara Lee, which is totally fine. Hamburger buns because I was trying to get turkey burger patties so we could have turkey burgers again. So I think I'll just run to the store. Um, I don't know if I'll have time today or tomorrow, but hopefully in the next day or two, I'll run into Walmart and just grab the turkey burger patties and the pork loin and we'll be good to go. I got some eggs. I only bought a dozen because I'm going to hard boil some for snacks, but we don't usually eat a whole lot of actual regular eggs. I usually eat egg whites every day. And then these are like my favorite chicken sausages. So this chicken apple, it's a Sam's Choice brand. So it's only available at like Walmart or Sam's Club. It's so good. And the macros for the macros, it's really great. It's only three grams of carbs and three grams of fat, but there's 15 grams of protein. So sometimes I'll saute one of these up and I'll like cook up those vegetables and just eat like a, like a sausage and vegetable like thing for lunch. Or I've added this to pasta. I'll do a spaghetti squash. So I say pasta, but it's spaghetti squash. I'll do like a spaghetti squash and I cook that up and then I add this to it and some seasonings and like butter. It is so good, you guys. So these are perfect for quick lunches for meal prepping. They're fully cooked, so you can eat them cold if you wanted to, or you just brown them really quickly on the stovetop. Highly recommend them. They are delicious. And then I got Texas toast for when we do spaghetti. And then these little funfetti mini pancakes are one of Aniston's favorites. So that is everything I got from the grocery store. Like I said, I'm sorry to be rushing through this because obviously my camera died, so I'm on my phone. Um, but I hope you guys are all having a fantastic week. I hope everybody had a great weekend and you are all staying safe and healthy. Um, I'm sorry, life is just so insane that my uploads are coming like... <laughs> There, I'm uploading videos a lot later than I anticipated, so I'm sorry for that. But things will be slowing down soon with school getting over and baseball being done. So I hope you guys all have a fantastic week.